What up guys, I'm that man they call Grizzle and welcome back to another episode of Gamers Who Don't Know Shit. Today I'm going to show you how you can change your windshield wiper pump on your 2007 Toyota Tundra. Alright you guys, your pump is located underneath the reservoir. Uh, to take this off here, you need to take that bolt out. There's one bolt there and one bolt over there. Alright guys, I've taken the bolts out. This is how it stands here. Uh, you have one connector that goes in here that needs to be taken out and you have one connector back here that one needs to be taken out and then here's your feed hose that goes into the actual pump right here this is your pump uh, this hose needs to be taken off this is your feed line to your nozzles that needs to be taken off as well all right guys this is your pump it's just pushed in there and sealed take yourself a little screwdriver and get this all out because your new one comes with everything you need anyway. Oh, there we go. Just like that. Now, it's going to be smart of you to just dump some of this out. Or all of it if you have a clean bucket. That way it's not, uh... That way it's not splashing up on you and stuff, but... I'm not gonna do that. All right, guys, here's your new one. I got this at AutoZone. Uh, I'm assuming that's the part number right there, so you can pause it and get it right there. Um, but this is the new one here, and it already has that seal right here. So you just wanna push this down in there so that it seals with this connector facing towards the top of the reservoir. What I'm gonna do, Let's take that seal off here and get the seal in there first. Seems like the best case scenario. Make sure it's seated around that ring nice. And then take your new one and you're just gonna push it on in there. You're gonna have to twist it a little bit. Hopefully this ring doesn't fall in there and I have to dump everything out. All right. All right, new one's in. Now we just need to hook it back up. All right. What we're gonna do is lay it like this so that this nozzle where your inlet hose goes doesn't leak out and we're gonna put that back on there so that it doesn't leak out and we're gonna set it up make sure everything is seated right when you do that if you leave this in here it's still gonna leak out the top a little bit but you're gonna save yourself having to dump this out and find a clean rag or clean uh, clean bucket or something to save your windshield wiper fluid or just dump it out and get new ones it's up to you so I'm gonna go ahead and get these connectors out of the way from where it sits we're gonna set this down in there right where the holes go And then we're going to reconnect these connectors. Like I said, there's one on this back side. Just click it in. And then there's one right here that you can click in. Oh, there we go. Alright. Now you just put your, uh, put your bolts back in. Turn your car on and see if it works. Alright guys, I got the car on. We're going to see if this is my problem. Hopefully it works. Oh, it pumped through pretty quickly too. All right, guys, that's how it's done. You got any questions, you know what to do. But don't forget to like my shit. Comment, subscribe, and I'll catch y'all on the next one. Hoo!